To prep the device, verify marker lumen patency by flushing it with saline until saline exits the marker port. After the index procedure, exchange the procedural sheath for an 038 inch or smaller guide wire. Advance the device over the wire until the guide wire exit port is at skin level. Remove the guide wire, then continue advancing the device until mark is observed coming from the marker lumen. Lift the lever to open the foot and gently retract the device against the vessel wall. Stabilize the device at 45 degrees. Depress the plunger with your right thumb to deploy the needles. Use your right thumb on the handle and with two fingers, gently pull the plunger back and out until the suture is taut. Then use the quick cut to cut the suture. Release any tension on the vessel wall Lower the lever to close the foot. Retract the device until the guide wire exit port is visible above the skin line. Reintroduce the guide wire to maintain access and pull both the suture limbs out from the proximal guide. Wrap the rail around your left index finger and pull taut to remove excess slack. Back out the per-close prostyle device while maintaining guide wire access. The suture trimmer can be used to advance the knot. Adopt a single-handed position to continue advancing the knot over the wire. Apply slow, consistent increasing tension. When bleeding is controlled, remove the guide wire and continue advancing the knot. Pull on the white-tipped non-rail to lock the suture knot tightly in place. Pull back the thumb knob to open the suture gate at the distal end of the suture trimmer. Load both suture limbs into the suture gate before releasing the thumb knob. Pull the red lever to trim the suture limbs. Perform active confirmation of hemostasis.